Moving up now for the first. Just the field of three here in the first. Uh, the other runner, General Jaylet, reared uh, in the prelim and uh, damaged the sulky, so it's out of the uh, event here. And we'll chase up further details as to whether it's going round in the next. Moving up well behind the gate here for the first event. It's another year of uh, harness racing gets underway here at Warrigal. For 2016, we're set to go. And they're off and running in the first. Was a pretty even line out of the machine too. Coco's Delight just snagged back a little bit at the start. Uh, showing good speed there was Clonbelow from the uh, two alley. Is going to work across here with Misty Cullen and they'll uh, vie for the early lead. Misty Cullen's got a little bit too much pace though and works across now. Gets the full length in front and finds the lead. Clonbelow again second position as they settle fully into stride. And about six metres away in third spot now was Coco's Delight. About to swing into the straight the first time. And we're just over two circuits left to go, about 1,800 metres still left to travel. And it's Misty Cullen, the leader. Margin about five metres. Second is Conbelog as they come down the straight the first time. They've got just on two circuits left to travel. And third and last of the three runners as they go past the winning post this time as Coco's Delight. Turning out of the straight and towards the back, they're inside the 1600 metres and there's no change in the order. And Misty Cullen runs it to suit. Leads by a sulkish length to Clombelog in second as they go to the back. And last of the three runners now, as they swing towards the 1400 metre mark, is uh, still Coco's Delight. So they're about to straighten for the run down the back. They have just on uh, a lap and a half to go. Just over that now. And Misty Cullen is the leader. Five metres in front. Second is Clon Belogue, racing behind the leader after electing to take that trail early. And Coco's Delight handed up from the inside draw and now settles down at the rear. Inside the 1200 metre mark, they're not breaking any records in front. And it's Misty Cullen, the leader. Margin about four or five metres. Still no moves at this stage. Clombelog races second, behind the leader, and three back the inside now is Coco's Delight, who sees them all. About to turn into the straight this time. They have just on a circuit left to go. Bell about to chime here in the first, and leading the way is Misty Cullen. Does it in good style as they come down in front of us once more. And down to the winning post, it leads five metres. Clombelog racing in second, and still last of the three runners is Coco's Delight. Turning out of the straight towards the back, it'll be a sprint home here as they head into the final circuit and Misty Cullen ups the uh, tempo a bit now. It's about seven metres in front as they go to the back the final time from Clombelog in second spot and still last of the three runners now is uh, Coco's Delight. In the back towards the 550 metre mark and Misty Cullen held together as the leader. Uh, Clombelog gets a little bit closer in second spot now has picked up the bit again and back behind those runners there as they swing off the bat was Coco's Delight inside the 400 metre mark still the leader is Misty Cullen going well four metres clear Clombelog to the outside now starts a forward move and this will push uh, Coco's Delight up the track three deep but on the turn 200 metres to go they've still got to catch this leader Misty Cullen he hasn't moved on it yet it's still four metres in front Second as they swing for home was Clombelog in the centre, out deeper on the track then was Coco's Delight but in the straight and he hasn't moved on Misty Cullen yet, it's well clear and Misty Cullen is uh, going to come down and score a nice win, wins it by about four or five metres on the post of Clombelog second and third and last of the three was Coco's Delight.